Hey, yo, I don't know who needs to hear this, but I'm getting straight into it. Because I know I go through this a lot. I know a lot of us wrestling fans go through this a lot. But stop coming to us talking about, oh, I can't believe you still watch wrestling. You're such a big-ass kid. That shit is so fake. Like, listen, for one, I'm a grown-ass man. I'm going to watch what the fuck I want to watch, okay? Two, don't you watch movies? Don't you watch TV shows and series and shit? When your emotions are into those TV shows and series and movies, don't y'all know that shit fake, right? That's a strip for it. And a lot of times, these actors are not even doing their own stunts. See, the thing with professional wrestling, these guys are doing their own stunts daily and weekly, every day, bro. Like, so when people be coming at me about that shit, what I ask them back is... Cause you put your body on the line. Cause you go out there and risk your body being injured like they do every day and every week. Bro, the answer is hell no. Cause I'm 31. I know when I did work a nine to five, my body would be hurt from the fucking nine to five. And I'm not even taking bumps and bruises like they is. You got people like Owen Hart who literally, rest in peace, he died in the ring. You got people like Mick Foley. He lost his ear in the ring. You got people like uh, Draws. He's paralyzed for life from the ring. You got people like Big E who don't even know if he's going to be able to come back to wrestle from injuries in the ring. So, bro, like... Stop just stop coming to us with that oh it's fake shit, bro. It's not gonna get me to stop what liking or watching wrestling, bro. I love this shit. I understand this shit. And maybe if you watch and put some thought into it and stop trying to follow what everybody else think, you could understand this shit too.